So, 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 how are you going to email it to me? Or how are you going to get it to me? But can I email on Mail You can, yeah. You got to use MailDrop, okay? It'll ask if you want to use MailDrop or not, all right? Yeah. I'll figure it out. Taylor can help you do that. Taylor's, Taylor's figured that out. Thank you for filming us here, Taylor. You're welcome, Greg. So, are you ready? Me? Yeah. Yeah, I'm ready. You ready? Is Mark ready? Yeah. Is he filming? I've got to get it on here. Okay, there you go, Mark. We're going to try. <laughs> Is it going to work? Is it gonna work? I don't know if it's, is it gonna work? I hope it works. Okay. Okay, Hey, Greg. Hey, Hayden. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. When we say we're gonna do Elder Law Report Unplugged, we really are gonna do it unplugged. Cause yeah, it unplugged at long distance. Hayden, where are you? I'm in Las Vegas. I'm here on the strip at. Hayden just took a trip to go to Las Vegas and uh, um, and flew and quit our, quit working here. I think she, she just. Are you are you coming back? Oh yes. Coming back. Okay. So you just you and Mark are having fun. Oh yes. He's had a show here, and I get to come because I can stay with him, and he has time off, so we managed to have a little fun. What kind of show does Mark have there? Walk with me, pardon me. Turn, turn, turn it around. It's a shot show. He deals with military factories. That's north. Casinos there are, and how many hotels and casinos there are, 
It's just unbelievable. Just money, money, money everywhere. And some of the hotels don't even have labels that most people would even recognize for clothing and things like this. It's just, just don't, don't risk it. You're forewarned. You know what the losers and the winners are now. So make your plans. Protect your money. Protect your assets. Way to, one way to secure your money and property is to appoint someone to handle your legal and financial affairs, you know, if you can't, right? And to be able to make moves with the money and to protect the money, to activate benefits. That's great insurance to have general durable powers of attorneys, healthcare power of attorneys, living wills and wills in place. And then... We've seen the consequences so many times of people who didn't. And we've got mom in the nursing home with Alzheimer's and dad can't do anything because she half owner of everything and he can't make decisions for her so and of course you know with the husband and wife are both reversed and, and those things are so they're so sad so sad i agree i couldn't agree more i mean um i mean you know i think a lot of people are gambling with their homes too trying to pass them through the will they don't have long-term care insurance and you know statistically um 70% of seniors over 65 are going to need some type of long-term care in their life, either in-home, assisted living, or nursing home care, and that costs a lot of money, right? That costs big, big dollars, right? Big money. Yes, in fact, I read something recently that it was even more than I thought. It's just a expensive. I mean, I think you've saved a, I, my house is paid for. I, it would, in three years, it would be gone. So, you know, people will not, not have protective deeds on their home, ladybird deeds, life estate deeds, and that's really unfortunate because a lot of times that's where, you know, you are gambling with your home and other assets uh, in danger of losing those because of those statistics um, that 70% of seniors over 65 are going to need some type of long-term care. Um, and Peyton, do we draft those types of documents? Do we do those types of things? Beautiful we do beautiful documents. I don't know. We do work very hard. To just in all, you know, without joking aside, we work very hard to do those. And uh, we'd be glad to help anyone out there who has some questions uh, and would not like to be gambling with their future, okay, and their assets and their families. So, Absolutely. so yeah. Hayden, thank you so much for thank you so much for coming to us from Vegas, okay? Thank you, Greg. I enjoy talking to y'all. Okay, bye-bye. What do you want to do next week, Greg? I thought we already had something. Oh, about that. Senior and Scams. Seniors and Scams. Mm -hmm. That's what we're doing next week. Seniors and Scams. So come back next week, and we'll be here at 10 o'clock every Friday morning for the Elder Law Report. I think that's like the first one you've ever made.